Welcome and thank you for joining Oil & Gas 360. We're here at Intercom's London Oil & Gas Conference with Acorn Energy's Chief Executive Officer, John Moore. Thanks for joining us, John. Thank you for having me. So Acorn's an, uh, an interesting holding company comprised of four po portfolio companies. Tell us a little bit about the structure of these companies as well as your primary portfolio companies. So our structure at the holding company is kind of the magic at Acorn because we have four companies. Each one is involved in digital energy solutions, capital light business models that help make infrastructure smarter. And the way that we have four companies, and each one of the companies is sort of managed independently, and each entrepreneur sort of feels like they're running their own business, so they're really entrepreneurial. And we generally own 100% of the company, but on exit, the economics, after we get our capital back, are sort of split 85% for, for our shareholders, 15% for the management team. So we've made two management teams rich, and we've got four management teams that want to get rich. All right. Can you walk us through each one of the portfolio companies? Yes. So we have three companies th uh, that are involved in uh, security and reliability, and those three companies are DSIT, which is based in Israel, which does monitoring of underwater energy infrastructure, and there's about 3,500 of those uh, around the world. It's about a billion-dollar market opportunity. We have a company in Atlanta, Georgia, called Omnimetrics that monitors emergency backup generators, and we do business all over the world. And then we have a company, uh, a smart grid company called GridSense that monitors transformers, and transformers are sort of the connective tissue of the electric grid. And then we have U.S. Seismic, which is basically creating a large uh, subsurface internet system for m better monitoring unconventional oil, and that's in Los Angeles. So I want to focus on U.S. Seismic. Um, how are your clients using this new systems in the oil and gas space? So the, the, the clients are using our devices permanently in the borehole, and what they're doing is they're using the imaging to be able to better figure out how to drill the laterals, where to place the laterals, uh, where to ide ideally place the fracture stages, because about 50% of fracture stages today produce zero hydrocarbons, and then they use our sensors to monitor while fracking, so to make certain that they get the most complete fracturing of the subsurface. So, so, so you guys aren't actually out there executing the projects. You are manufacturing and creating the technology for oil service companies or for EMP companies to use themselves. That's correct. That's we make tools, and our idea is, is that we have very high margins, and we have a disruptive technology, and our partners are the service companies. Okay, I see. So how are your customers measuring that su success of using your project, or what's the return? How are they measuring a, a, a return on investment, so to speak? So the... Ultimately, what we do is we sell to the oil and gas companies who are looking to improve their completions from 5 or 10 percent productivity or ultimate estimated recoveries to 10 or 20 percent. So that's a huge return on our, the cost of our sensor systems, which costs about two and a half million dollars for a hundred level system. And the oil service companies are, of course, you know, looking at our devices to be able to increase the size of the market opportunity. So micro seismic is a new area of seismic and we believe that it could you know, increase the size of the seismic industry from a $14 billion a year business to $24 billion, $36 billion and create a new golden age of seismic. So it's lots of new interesting technologies. What, what potential catalysts should prospective investors be looking for throughout 2013 and even into 2014? Well, we're expecting to announce some uh, major customer trial results. We have a super major, which we're in the middle of a trial with right now, and uh, that could be transformational for our business. Uh, we also have publicly announced that we're expecting an order from a, uh, 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 a national oil company and one of the world's largest seismic service companies. So we think that initial orders from those companies, them learning how to use our tools and then using it to figure out how to transform their business, that's what 2013 is going to be about. We wish you all the best and thanks again for joining us, John. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, Brian.